Once you finish with the hedge maze, you get sent back to the Masked Mutant's headquarters. So let's see... We don't have anything else to do here, so let's go into the elevator. It will take us to another floor, where we have to fight another villain. Uh, this time, we'll be fighting the nasty Pinky Flamingo! <laughs> Ooh, what's the matter? Suddenly getting that sinking feeling? You think it's quicksand, don't ya? You should be so lucky. This is slow sand. Twice as torturous. Same eventual end result. <laughs> we might as well toast your untimely end, kid. He has mud in your eye. Pinky is a very mean person. To get out of the slow sand, you want to press the control button and grab the tail of the rat right here. Then you want to follow the rat. If you don't grab the rat's tail on the first try, don't worry, the rat runs around in a, in a little bit of a circle. So you get a few opportunities to grab the rat's tail. Now the rat is leading us through a maze. So let's see, down here. Yeah, we get to see an awful lot of rat butt in this area. Ah, uh, here we go. So this is the end of the maze. You want to take a left hand. Hey, don't push me, rat. Don't push me. Ugh. Okay, so you, you want to take a left hand turn and then right hand turn, you're at the exit. That's how you solve that challenge. Great, so we're back in Pinky Flamingo's area. Let's see, this is a dead end. Okay, that's a dead end. Well, in addition to having the rat challenge, we also have the control room. It's near the elevators. Ah, okay, here we go. Here are the elevators. The control room is near the elevators. Right here. Excellent. So let me grab my weapon. Grab my weapon. Use the uh, tilde button to change inventory items. So yeah, I've got I've got the comic book and my weapon. And also a security alert! Ah! Use your weapon on this robot to defend yourself. And let's turn off this machine by pressing the space bar. Now we get to watch some news reports about the mass mutant conquering the world. This just in. The mysterious green beam has just leveled Washington, D.C. And the sewage is A sooner the world will be mine! <laughs> no! The evil masked mutant is conquering the world! That's not good. Only I can save the world now. Well, me and the League of Good Guys, where are they? Aren't they supposed to be helping me? Well, let's leave. Now that we've seen that video footage and we've gone up against Pinky Flamingo, an elevator opens. We'll take it to the next floor. Oh hey, this is the bottom floor! Oh, maybe we can escape! This is great! We'll just get out of here! Ah! Mass Mutant! No! Run! Run! Back to the elevator! Get that kid! <sighs> Scary. Hmm, where is this? Ah, I know this floor. So we need to find a key to open up this door. We also have a jukebox over here. Oh yeah! Grab your partner to and fro, spin him around and do si do Hee ha ha! Okay, so he ha <laughs> we have the printing room here. Let's 
go inside, and this was actually in the book. There was a printing room in the basement of the book where they made Mass Mutant comics. And that really confused me because we're inside a comic book right now. They make the comics inside the comics? It's weird. Uh, we have this danger button, so you don't want to step on that button. Yeah, see that red button? It shoots you up over here! So yeah, you, you don't want to get crunched up by the printing machine. Instead, you want to go to the next room, grab a key. Excellent. Now let's leave. But uh-oh! That bug alien we fought earlier? It's back for revenge! Okay, we have to fight it. This is kind of a cool puzzle. What we want to do is shove it on that red target. So we need to... Okay, here we go. Shove it at the red target. Like that! Perfect! You have to angle yourself properly. It can be hard to get the angle correct. That's how you defeat that evil villain. And I don't think we're gonna see that villain for the rest of the game. We defeated a super villain. For real. Yeehaw! Everybody dance! Woohoo! What's else in this hallway? Is there anything else in this hallway? No, it's just a dead end. Alright. So let's get back to that locked door using the key we just got. Now this is an optional challenge. You can skip it if you want. This is a challenge to get uh, superhero gear. You don't have to get the superhero gear in this game. That's, that's optional. All the pieces of superhero gear can be skipped. So if you're not collecting the superhero gear, just go back to the elevator, skip this entire challenge. I am going to try to get the superhero gear, though. So this is a maze. It's a maze. We want to go through the maze and find the gloves. They're hidden somewhere. You can use these bug monsters as a guide, right? Because those bug monsters show up somewhere close. Ah, there we go. Yeah, if you try to follow the bug monsters, you're like, hey, 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 that's, that's how we know where to go. There, there's a bug monster here. Ah, bug monster here. So this is the right spot. Oh, mul multiple bug monsters. Ow. Oh, I think I walked myself in a circle, though. Yeah, I think I did. So, here, maybe. Here, maybe. Maybe, maybe here. And then here. Yes, this is it. This is it. See, I can see the superhero gear right there. It's the superhero gloves! Keep searching for the rest of the superhero costume, kid! And now I just need to find my way back through the maze. Let's see... This is the double wall. It's got like a double wall of ventilation fans. Let me go far away from that, and then around here... I think this is it. Fortunately, that bug villain did nothing. Uh, the bug villain's at the top of the stairs. Yes, this is it. This has to be the exit. Right? No? Yes, right. The bug villains at the top of the stairs will shoot things at you. Shoot things at a distance. Shoot like slime balls or whatever. So you do have to dodge. See those green balls? Doom. Yeah. You have to dodge. Try to try to dodge them. Those hurt you. If you get hit too many times, you have to restart the level over again from from the elevators. And you you, you lose the gloves. You lose the superhero gloves too. Which is obviously not good. We want to keep the superhero gloves. Ooh, and here we have a challenge. We have uh, two elevators open. Which one do we take? The one on the left or the one on the right? Well, the one on the right leads to a superhero outfit challenge. And like I said, I'm trying to get all the superhero stuff. Okay, so here you want to run forward and grab this. It is a ray gun. Yes, and you can use it to shoot these, these monsters. 
That's pretty cool. Uh, this room here is really cool looking. It's shaped like the Masked Mutant's face. You can see the mask. There's nothing inside this room besides a bunch of uh, robot monsters, but it's a really cool room nonetheless. What you want to do is follow the pathway here to the side of those elevators, and this gives us a jumping challenge. So jump by pressing the enter button. So you're going to press forward and enter to do a running jump. Jump. And this can be rather tricky because you need to jump from platform to platform without falling off. Alright. Running jump. We've got another running jump here. Oh no! And I jumped too far. I jumped too far. So I fell off and died. Tragic. That's not good. So I have to restart this level from the beginning again. That's okay. Fortunately, the, the ray gun is really close, as is the challenge. So, running jump. No! Oh, come on! Really? Really? So the jumping challenges in this game are pretty difficult. We, we're... We're gonna have some really tough ones later on. Uh, this one is supposed to be rather easy. It's only a few jumps. There. There. And there! Got it! So we have two of those robots here. You want to destroy both those robots and grab the next superhero item, which is the utility belt! Good job, kid! You found the utility belt. Now keep searching for the rest of the outfits! Good, destroyed that villain, and... now. Oh! See if we can get back to those elevators. Run, jump. Good. Want to angle myself perfectly. Run and jump. Good. Run and jump. Good. And I'll just jump straight to the exit here instead of jumping to that platform. Jump. Got it. Okay. Done. Done, done, done. So, now back into the elevator, and the mass mutant steals the ray gun because it's far too powerful. It, it would be really easy to beat the game if you had the ray gun all the time. So that's why it gets taken away as soon as you go in the elevator.